Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to this long-awaited Harold Johnson. My career. We are back on it, and as you can see, the playoff picture. Don't look in the top right. All right, that, that that's just gonna spoil where we are. Last episode, we were fighting for the six, seven, and eight seed. We there was a possibility we fell out, but we didn't. We clinched the playoffs. Here are the standings. The Magic somehow got the fourth seed. And by the way, this is like pre-trade deadline, some pre-trade deadline. I did put James Harden on the Nets. So, but the Magic do have their team. Like they have Fournier, they have Gordon, they have Vucevic. So them being the fourth seed isn't too crazy, I guess. Um, but yeah, the Wizards got the seventh seed, and we did get the eighth seed. The Atlanta Hawks ended up winning their last game against us, but I mean they were already out of it. Um, I guess we were fighting for the we weren't fighting for the sixth seed, but the Wizards ended up winning, and they had a tiebreaker over us due to them winning. Oh, okay, never mind. I thought they won a game against us earlier. But yeah, we did lose by one point in our final game of the season. It sucked because if we win this game, we get the seventh seed and we don't have to face the Brooklyn Nets. Yeah, now we have to go against the Brooklyn Nets in round one. But let's officially sim the regular season. Joel Embiid is your NBA MVP. Um, Harold Johnson is your rookie of the year. 29 points, 11 rebounds. We'll round up seven assists, a steal, and a block, shooting 50, 40, 90 as a rookie. That is absurd. Now, whether Harold stays with the Cavs or not after this season, we'll find out. Will we make it out of the first round? I highly doubt it because we have to go against the Nets. But I don't know if Harold, I have some teams in my head. I'm not saying, but if he were to leave the Cavs, I have some interesting teams. If not, we need help on this team because this team needs help desperately. Norton Clarkson does get. Six man of the year, averaging 19 a game. Giannis gets defensive player of the year. Christian Wood, most improved. And Steve Nash is your coach of the year. And I'm going to, that. yeah, that's our executive. Whoever Jack turned, he's fake. But we got executive of the year as the eighth seed. We were top 10 in power rankings. And I mean, we were, what, the Cavs were like a top five worst team last season. So yeah, that makes sense. And Harold does make... All NBA first team over Giannis, over AD, over KD. Harold makes it averaging nearly 30. Well deserved. Here are the rest of the all NBA teams. What KD average? Oh, he only averaged 23. All right, Giannis only averaged 26. We already know Giannis' stats. Yeah, no, no. All right, Harold definitely deserved it. All defensive first team. Um, Harold Johnson does not make an all defensive team. Obviously, all rookie first team, he makes it. Um, and there it is. We are the eighth seed going up against the Nets. Here is the full playoff bracket. Uh, no surprises, really, honestly, besides the Timberwolves made the playoffs and the Pelicans and the Kings made the playoffs. So those are really the only surprises. Yeah, this team is going to be it's going to be something. If you got what our roster looks like, we got Lonzo Ball. We traded for the trade the deadline. We traded um, Darius Garland, which apparently worked out for the Pelicans because they're the fourth seed. And Garland had a solid season, so I guess it worked out for them. But we have Lonzo, Colin Sexton, Harold, obviously. We have Larry Nance and Jarrett Allen here is our bench. It's, 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 it's tough, but let's get into game one against the Nets, and hopefully we don't get blown out of the water. All righty, we are here in Brooklyn for game one. The Nets are 19 games better than us. This is odd because we just went from Gerald and the Heat just completely dominating everyone, especially record-wise. And now here we are as the 8th seed going up against the 1th seed. A, a bit different here, but, you know, we move. Um, KD is playing the power forwards, and they have Enos Kanter somehow. Um, but if if Larry Nance can't guard him, I might have to put myself on Kevin Durant. But we'll see as Jared Allen loses a tip, and the Nets are going to start off with the ball. First round game one of this NBA playoffs. I was going to say NBA finals. We ain't there yet. As Colin Sexton is going to let James Harden go right to the basket and score immediately. Oh, James Harden. Yeah, he greened that. And the Nets take a one-point lead. I have been... I haven't scored every point. But I've either assisted... I don't know what I'm trying to say here. But that's a fading three that I didn't want to take. I wanted to take a standing three. Oh, Jared Allen almost got the rebound there. Uh, James Harden again with the ball. That's all they've been doing is just giving it to Harden. 
Colin Sexton, I'm going to need you to play some solid defense here. Cause, and, oh, I thought he was going to take that three. Larry Nance is not fast enough to keep up with KD. See, that's the thing I'm worried about. Larry Nance Jr. is not fast enough to keep up with Kevin Durant. So, that's, I have Bruce Brown on me, though. So, I need, really need to exploit this as I'm going right to the basket, throwing up the layup. And if you didn't know, Harold is actually like a Kevin Durant clone. He's literally just Kevin Durant. So... That's interesting. We got basically KD versus KD out here, except Harold's not that good. Oh, my God, James Harden. Oh, Colin Sexton, you got, you're got open, bro. Bro? That's not a word. Ah, uh, he missed it. All right, Colin Sexton, yeah. Why is why is Bruce Brown wearing number 14? That's not a thing you should be doing. That's Enos Canner. I am not worried about you shooting at all. Kyrie, though, I am a bit worried about. They're going to give it up to Bruce Brown. I almost got there, and he knocks down the three. All right, I'm going to sub that for the first time in this game. We are up by two, and it's a tied game. I will 100% take that. Um, do they have Blake Griffin? I don't think I gave him Blake Griffin. Well, I Bruce Brown is not, I am going to average like 50 in this series because Bruce Brown cannot guard me. I All my points are in the paint. I have 12 points, four rebounds, three assists already, and it's the start of the second quarter. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> I don't know how Larry Nance has been doing on KD. Um, that's not a good sign. Uh, apparently not very well. That's what's been happening. Uh, oh, that's just average. That's the season averages. I thought it was going to show what he has on the game. See, Bruce Brown can't do anything against me. That's an and one. I'm just going to keep abusing it and going to the paint on him. I currently have my takeover. The Nets are still in this. I mean, they're still in this. Oh, step back. Pull up. It's good. Knocking down my first three. I think I'm like one for four, though, on the night from downtown. That was pretty sick. I think the takeover helped it, though. As we, I give us a five-point lead. Kyrie is going to launch it from downtown, and he's going to miss. Jared Allen with the rebound. They are just launching threes tonight, and it's not working. Uh, I'm yeah, literally right by Bruce Brown, but I did not freaking release that well at all. Oh, I'm on KD for the first time this game. He's going to do a post fadeaway, and I'm right there to guard it. Kevin Durant misses, and we're on the fast break. Lonzo Ball from downtown. It's good. Lonzo Ball gives us an 8-point lead, and we're now on a 12-4 run. I already have 19, 5 rebounds, and 4 assists in this game. Dinwiddie's launching it from downtown, and he misses. They are just chucking up threes in this game. We can now take a double-digit lead. I have KD on me now, though. Oh, I'm not going to take that shot. I'm not going to take that shot. All right. I got KD on me. I'm going to call for the ISO. KD's a solid defender, but not solid enough. Pull up jumper fate. Ah, it's not good enough. All right, I'm going to start that again. We have a six-point lead in the second quarter, and we're up by 12 going into halftime. This was not expected at all coming into this game. The Nets, they can't stop us defensively. That's the problem with this Nets team. I, I didn't expect this. Start of the third quarter, and we are currently have a 12-point lead. Colin Sexton was open for like half a second, though. Straight to the bat, and that was a bad shot. I didn't expect him to take a jump shot there. And he got blocked by James Harden. Uh, James Harden now with the ball. He has 20 points for the Nets. KD has 14, and Kyrie has 7 on not so good shooting. As KD launches another 3. What is this Nets team doing when it comes to 3s? All right, Kyrie, you are not guarding me. And that's a bucket. I am abusing this Nets team defensively. 26 points on 60% shooting so far in this game. That is absurd. They cannot stop me right now. We're on another fast break. The Nets can do nothing offensively. Colin Sexton from downtown. It's off. Ooh, Lonzo, Lonzo almost got the offensive rebound. He's playing solid. I think he has 11 points in this game already. Um, I almost got the steal there. I'm also on triple double watches. James Harden gets the floater to go. He now has 26 on 9 for 15 shooting. Alonzo going to do the same thing. I've been running the pick and roll Alonzo and it's been working. And this time it's going to work again. Alonzo ball to the basket. 13 points for him in his first ever playoff game. And we're now up by 18 points on this Brooklyn Nets squad. Not what I expected at all. James Harden from downtown. It's off. We're on another fast break. Giving it up to Colin Sexton. Give it back to me. I'm going to pull up a contested three. Oh, it's almost good. All right. I am up by 14. I mean, they, they're starting to come back a bit. 
but I am one assist away from a triple double. I'm gonna pop that. That should not have been the shot I took. I'm guarding KD now. No, never mind. I guess I'm not guarding KD. I'm one assist away from a triple double though, and I expect to get it on the next possession. Bruce Brown, what do you? Oh, Bruce Brown, Bruce Brown, get that out of here! You know, no, no. Uh, Larry Nance with the ball. I can't speak. Uh, I'm going straight to the basket. Yeah, no, this is easy. 30 points. There it is, Bruce Brown. Wait, Bruce Brown, no. Who got the steal on that? Oh, wait, I blocked Bruce Brown. I legit already forgot what that possession, what happened there. I'm guarding, Can I'm, I mean, Harold 6'10". I can guard Cantor. All right, in the post, not very strong, so probably not. But James Harden trying to draw a foul, and it's off. Give it to me, Lonzo. I need the ball, and you know what? Lonzo, come set the screen. I want you to get me this triple-double. You've been amazing this game. Let's see if he can cut to the basket. Nope. Okay, we'll try this again, Lonzo. Lonzo, let's try this again. Give you another chance. I'll give you another chance. Lonzo, give me this triple dump. You missed all, oh, Lonzo. All right, well, I'm getting subbed out anyways. We have a, I think, 14-point lead. We, we now have a 22-point lead. All right. Not the way this game should have went. I might have to mess with the sliders a bit. I am playing power forward. So that's interesting. Lonzo, I want you to give me this triple double. Lonzo, get me this triple double Lonzo ball with the dunk. I don't know how many points he has, but it's got to be close to 20. 30 point triple double for Harold Johnson in game one of these NBA playoffs against the Brooklyn Nets. As someone's launching a three and it's off. I think that was Dinwiddie. Colin Sexton. I mean, I got my takeover. I also have Dinwiddie on me. Someone come set the screen so I can try and get some space. See if I can launch a three here. From downtown, it's a green 27-point lead on Brooklyn. I don't understand how they're not able to score. I'm, I might, um, you know, DJ with the sliders after this, turning up the CPU sliders. I'm not going to touch my sliders because I think they're fine. As Kevin Durant is going to get right by me. And he's going to get fouled. Well then, we dropped 130 points on the Nets and they didn't even score 100. That was not expected at all as Kyrie works on Isaiah Thomas with 10 seconds left. And I'm going to get the steal and that's going to be game. We're going to walk out game one with a huge win. I'm going I'm to just pull it. Screw it. I'm going to just pull it. Almost knock it down. 42 point triple double and we are going to win by, what is that? 45? 35? I think 35. I'm stupid. We are going to win by 35 points against the one-seeded Brooklyn Nets in Game 1. That is absurd, but I don't expect the Nets to play this bad all series. We'll see about Game 2, but that did not go as planned. The box score, James Harden tried. He dropped 28. KD dropped 25. Kyrie only 12 points. 0 for 4 from downtown, and then obviously the supporting cast is just not good enough. Dinwiddie did nothing. They do have Blake Griffin, I guess. Um, he did absolutely nothing. For the Cavs, 42-point triple-double, two blocks for Harold, 18 for 33, 5 for 13 from downtown. Buddy Heald off the bench was one, just a deciding factor, I guess. 23 points off the bench, knocking down five threes. That was huge. Lonzo Ball in his playoff debut drops 21 on 13 shots, only missing three. Isaiah Thomas, 11. So our bench, essentially... Helped us along with Harold 42. So 23 off the bench and then Lonzo's 21. That was huge. And then no one else really did anything. Colin Sexton didn't show up. Larry Nance is only here for defensive purposes. That has been the one problem with this team was offense, like scoring. That was the one problem this team really had. Harold had to do it all. And Buddy Heald and Lonzo Ball showed up luckily. So I doubt that's going to happen every game, especially next game. So Harold... Expect to be averaging 50 in this series, probably. But that's going to be for me. Leave a like, guys, and enjoy. Subscribe if you guys are new. GG.